Here we have a very nice little 2012 Ford Fiesta Z-Tech three-door hatchback in blue. Starts with the offside front tyre, easily a good six millimetres of tread there, so you've got loads of tread on the offside front tyre. Looking at the offside front alloy, you get the Z-Tech alloys, really nice clean condition with no curbing or scuffs. Looking down the offside of the vehicle, I personally cannot see any dents. There's a very light dink on the driver's door about um, sort of this section around here, so you can see there is a dink there. Um, slash borderline dent, it's not too heavy, um, so just be wary of that. Again, nothing too major. Around the offside front arch, lovely clean condition. Driver's mirror is spotless. Driver's door itself, again, very clean. There's a one or two light scratches that just need a bit of a mop and polish. You can see around the door edge, might need one or two little chips, uh, little nicks there. Again, light scratch there, needs a polish. Door sill's fine. Moving towards the rear arch and rear quarter. Uh, now I've just noticed, I don't know how I missed this, um, but there's a slight dent on the rear arch here. So it has dented the rear arch. Um, so you can see it's slightly um, knocked it out of line here as well. Uh, I don't know if you can see that on the video. There is a dent on the rear arch there, so just be wary of that, guys. Um, even on the rear quarter, that looks fine, nothing at all to report there. Looking on the uh, rear tyre, again, you're looking at about four to five millimetres of tread there on the offside rear. Looking at the rear alloy on the offside, very clean, no curbing or scuffs, couple of light scratches, that's all. Moving towards the rear end of the vehicle. On the rear bumper, immaculate condition again, no sign of any damage. Near side rear course is fine. Literally just one or two light scratches and that's all it really consists of. Inside the boot you've got your parcel shelf, there's your age related plates. Lovely clean condition inside. And you've got your inflation kit and locking wheel nut in there as well. So everything is in good order there. Moving around to the near side rear tyre again, we're looking at a good 5mm of tread. Looking on at the rear alloy on the near side. Once again, a very clean looking alloy there with no curbing or scuffs. And looking down the near side of the car, right, there's definitely no dents there. One or two minor dinks. Again, they're very light, probably car park dinks. A couple of minor touchings on the door edge there, and literally just one or two light scratches that will need a bit of a polish. Door mirror is fine, front arch is clean, and a good 6mm on the front tyre. So plenty of uh, tread left on all four tyres. A little bit of curbing on the outside edge of this alloy, as you can see. So this one might need a little bit of a refurb. And moving towards the front end of the vehicle, one or two stone chips on the front will need a couple of touch-ins. There is just one or two, and the bonnet is actually very clean as well. So lovely looking car for its age, clearly been taken care of. Inside, got the full cloth interior, and as you can see, even the interior is immaculate as well. No damage there. Front passenger seats also in a lovely condition. Looking in the back here, again, very tidy, very clean, no sign of any damage at all there. Even carpets and mats are lovely and clean as well. Stepping inside the vehicle itself, looking at your dashboard sense console, all very tidy, there's no scratches or marks. The steering's also in a nice condition as well. To be fair, it still looks like a brand new car. We do get two sets of keys with the vehicle, as you can see there, so two keys with the car. Looking at the display here whilst I start the vehicle. As you can see, there's no issue at all starting the car. 19,328 miles on the clock. No symbols at all appearing on the dash either. And no issues at all with the radio. That works perfectly fine. You've got your blowers here. That works great. Air conditioning there as well. You've also got a rear heated screen and a, rear and a front heated screen as well so that's a nice feature manual box and taking a look at the documents now you've got one owner on the car which is clearly obvious as it's been taken care of and it's a lovely looking car very low mileage as well MOT expiry dates here of 23rd of November 2016 so plenty left on the MOT as well and just to top it off guys we've got the full service history the first one there is at 26 we've got a furrow stamp there at 5 so that's the franchise and then it's just been serviced at 17 and a half thousand miles so that's very recently done and there we go. So there we go guys, it's 2012 Ford Fiesta, a very little prep need doing to this car. The only thing I'd be worried about is that slight dent on the rear arch. Again, nothing too major, probably could get sorted out. But it's a lovely looking car, low mileage and full service history.